Welcome friends, welcome to Mexico City. Today we are going to attempt to try a lot of tacos. We're gonna comb the streets and just pretty much eat street tacos or tacos that face the street. There is a lot of choice. Huge amount of choice, so let's get to it. So we have two tacos here, longaniza, which is a sausage, which is a spicy sauce. With some cactus in it. Lapale. And I got uh, campechano, which is a combination of longaniza and some pork and fried onions. I really like this one. I like the I like the um, I like the mix of flavors from the two different kinds of meats. Yeah, a little bit crispy from being done on the grill. This is one of my favorite tacos. Very good. Yours? I like my. I really like the uh, the cactus. I can't. Napale. Napale. Yeah. It, it, it uh, adds a different texture and flavor to it. Yep. So my understanding is guisado refers to a stew cooked in these in these containers. And it could be any stew and you put it on and some people mix two or three together to get what they're looking for. What to know what you're up to? What to know what you're up to. I have no clue what I'm up to. Um, this is called tasty? Milanese. Okay. This is really good. Can I try yours? Mm -hmm. You want to hold? Yeah. It doesn't matter. I can just try a bit. I can try the bit that felt only just going to go. It's probably the easiest way. Thank Straight. You. Yours is really wet. Mm -hmm. Mine's well, definitely more stewy than yours. Mm -hmm. Oh, you made a mess. I made a mess. Ooh. I like the stewy. Really good. Do you want the uh, Roja? Do you want the Roja? Please. Which one's yours? <laughs> oh! Is it well? You're good. Okay. Let's see. 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 Let's see.
Do I roll it? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. <laughs> Beans, cheese. Steak. Can't go wrong. Steak. Can't go wrong. Fresh corn. Yeah. Yeah. Who's been keeping this secret from us? Yeah. <laughs> Who has been keeping this secret from us? I <laughs> don't La pieza le vale 19 y la orden de 3 flautas, ¿cómo está la orden? 56 con 3. tacos in this place. It was really loud inside. Yeah, so. Uh, a lot of hustle and bustle, a lot of music, so I thought we'd go over what we just ate. Um, we had suadero, which is beef brisket, mm -hmm. and longaniza, which is uh, sausage. sausage. And they're both cooked in beef fat, um, and it's absolutely fantastic cooked that way, which is different than the way we had them earlier, earlier today. today yeah. Yes. What was also fabulous was they had these little small onions that they also cooked in the beef fat. Yes, and that was absolutely fantastic, weren't they? Because they, they were. were sweet and soft and just great. And the other part I really like is that a lot of the restaurants have pickled peppers, but also include carrots for people like me who find the peppers just a little too hot. Yes. And the pepper, the pickled carrots are hot, but not as hot as the peppers. And they add a whole other flavor and level to the, to the flavor profile of your taco. I like the pickled peppers, but I, I like the carrots for texture. There you go. So I think that's it for today. No, no I cannot no, eat any more no tacos. No more tacos today. I am today. absolutely full of tacos. But that being said, we have not had El Pastor yet, and we see the Trumpo everywhere. But I found a street that apparently is just El Pastor restaurants. So that will be tomorrow's journey. Thanks for stopping by. See you again soon. Let's go. Ow.